most, if not all, public school systems obtain their funding from the state. So if the state slashes that funding, it affects everyone involved. It affects the teachers, the students, and the parents. Today I'll be informing you on the topic of budget cuts, their effect on the school system involved, and how people across the nation are taking action against them. According to the Center of Budgets and Policy Procedures, or the CBB, they reviewed 47 states. Of the 47 states they reviewed, 30 of them were found to have been funding, <coughs> to have been funding schools less than they did in the years 2008-2007. Those 30 states make up about 60% of the U.S. school population. According to another article by the CPBB, fundings for public schools for grades K-12 and for special needs kids have decreased by about 10% since the year 2010. These two examples show that Americans trend, these two examples show Americans trend in decreasing school funds over time. More often than not, the first programs that get cut by schools or our education and the physical education programs. The Huffington Post article, What We Lose When We Cut the Fine Arts, is an article that shows the emotions related when both students and teachers are forced to deal with budget cuts. The article shows the significance of the teacher-student relationship and the bonds that are formed. So, during a teacher's final farewell performance, during the teacher's senior performance, he was a course high school teacher. Um, her students gave her a farewell performance at the end of it. And the reason they gave her a farewell performance was because while she was on maternity leave having her uh, first child, uh, she was contacted and notified that she would not be able to teach high school any longer and that she would be demoted all the way down to teaching pre-K. performance was told to be uh, heartfelt and left all in tears. The teacher was giving her notice. In Chicago, where according to CPS.gov, three out of every four schools experienced a budget cut of some sort. Most of those who suffered a loss of funds also suffered a loss of staff members, with some budget cuts of about 78%. People around the U.S have begun to take action in the name of saving schools from budget cuts. Since this budget is an issue that affects teachers, students, and parents alike, it's only natural that all three groups <coughs> would have something important to say about these, the issue. According to the Sun News Network, a Chicago newspaper, on Monday, October 5th, 2015, uh, students at Roosevelt High School uh, skipped class and protested because of the lack of funds and the lack of teachers that they had because of budget cuts. One student was quoted and said, they, the teachers, wanted our futures to be great. And that's what their job is. Yet they, the school board, are continuously cutting our staff. So now who's supposed to do that for us? Another student was quoted and saying, imagine you live your entire life with no support system. And then you get a mentor, and your mentor follows you for the next three years. And you finally have something stable to depend on. Then imagine that you have that person ripped for you, from you because of school budget cuts. That's what happened to me and my mentor. The last example I have is from a school in Pennsylvania <coughs> where a teacher formed a play about budget cuts and its effect on students as well as the teachers. This article was cited on the HuffingtonPost.com. <coughs> it gave three monologues from the play from the perspective of three different teachers. One teacher who had a doctorate in education yet worked three other jobs to support her finances from education. Another who encouraged a student who had trouble dealing with his anger issues and his emotions decided to have him inducted in acting classes as a way to channel his anger. And finally was a guidance counselor who met a family who had next to nothing and the funds that she helped raise to support that family. 
family. In conclusion, budget cuts in the public school system is a serious matter and it affects everyone involved in more ways than one. Thank you.